Hey folks, Mike Klingensmith, All Seasons RV. Today I'm gonna to go over with you the brand new 2022 Alpha Wolf 26 DBH. Um, our location here, Northeast Ohio, Streetsboro, right off Route 14. Telephone numbers 330-564-0222. Visit our website, www.asrvs.com. If you have any questions throughout this video, feel free to uh, give us a call, check out our website. We do have detailed information on all the units we have in stock and the ones that are on order and coming into our dealership. So a little bit about the Alpha Wolf, especially the 26 DBH. Great family coach, double wide bunks, one slide out in that slide, you have a U-shaped dinette and a couch. So this can sleep about eight to 10 people depending on how you fit them in there. Um, so I'll just go right up front, come in power tongue jack, easy to get on and off your vehicle. Also has an LED light, so if you're docking up late at night or early in the morning, you can kind of see what you're doing. Uh, another cool feature, uh, it's small, but it's, it's awesome to have. A little uh, clip here for your chains and or your seven way plug can slip right in here. So it's not getting corroded. It's kind of kept put away. Very cool. We'll come with two 20 pound propane tanks through our dealership for all inclusive pricing. We do not charge prep, freight, destination fees. We do include full propane and a brand new battery in a box up front. So this model has a juice pack, which is a 50 watt solar panel already on the roof to help keep your battery charged. You're not plugged into your vehicle or plugged in shore power on the side. Keep this uh, battery charged. Also having that juice pack, they upgrade the battery from a 24 T series to a 27 T series, which is very nice to have. Also up front with your molded fiberglass front cap, which is less likely to fade over time. Uh, and it's a, it's a great look up front. They do already stick in the blue LED docking lights. So again, early in the morning, late at night, uh, those will, you know, bring off white so you can kind of see what you're doing. Um, all the way to the side, you have a full pass-through uh, storage compartment unit right here. We'll have your uh, motion sensor LED light inside. You have a 10 amp charger in there to control your solar. Uh, battery disconnect, so if you are plugged in on the side or, or at home, you just want to disconnect the battery. Instead of taking the wires off the battery, Come inside, hit that uh, red switch off, kills all power from your 12 volt. Also storage compartment doors held up by magnets, not little plastic clips that can potentially break if you forget that it's locked open. And it's the slam latch, so it slams nice and easy, uh, just like a motorhome would have. Uh, it has a really cool leash latch here for your furry friends. Just don't forget to remove them before you actually travel. I uh, don't want to pull Griswold. Also, your stabilizer jacks, all manual. Um, we, don't, we don't order them with the power jacks. You can get that as an option if you want. Um, if, if that's something you're interested in, just ask us for pricing. We can even install that here at our location. But the nice part about the manual stabilizer jacks, if anything happens to them, very easy, inexpensive to fix. You can easily turn those into power if you use a cordless drill as well. Zap them up and down, easiest way about it. Full power awning, comes out eight feet. They are adjustable on either side for sh uh, sunshade. Also has a little sun flap that flipped up on us because of the wind, but uh, blue LED strip lighting under your awning. Gives a really nice pop at night or early in the morning and gives you some, some nice light at night. Um, with those LED strip lighting, you do have blue LED accent lights behind your outdoor speakers as well. So this does have indoor outdoor speakers. Uh, nice TV mount here on the outside, cable hookup, 110 outlets. So nice thing about having 110 outlets on this side, on your camping side, not only for your TV, but if you have an electric skillet or something like that, you can easily plug it in here uh, late at night. As we passed over it, that's now passed over the outside uh, kitchen, outside entertainment area here. So you have a mini fridge ice maker, two burner cooktop, and a nice little dish tray here, condiment tray or something at least hold ice for you. Uh, for your tires, the, the new blacked out kind of chrome looking rims. Plus you have a tire pressure monitor system on here. So it's a quick check before you leave. Uh, if, if all the stems are green, you're good to go. If you're yellow or red, losing air pressure, you know, don't travel, at least fill up those tires before you travel. So. You don't have any uh, you know, this, uh, misfortunes. 
Uh, both entry doors, we have the nice mole ride, sturdy steps, three steps, easy to get in and out. <clears throat> Plus you have the oversized grab handle here for your main entry to easily go in and out. Um, the more ride sturdy steps are adjustable on both sides. Having the three step versus the two step, they do sell an optional handle uh, to go in and out as well. If you want that, again, give us a call. We'll be more than happy to price that out. So moving more towards the back of the unit, uh, this will come standard with the travel rack on the back and your spare tire with the cover. Travel rack can hold uh, handle 200 pounds, firewood, travel totes, bicycles, you name it, you can put it on the back, just don't exceed that 200 pounds. Plus it's coming standard with a backup observation camera. So observation camera wise, as long as your running lights are on, you have 100% uh, you know, visibility behind you while traveling down the road. Kind of takes some of your blind spots out, but again, you can at least see what's behind you while traveling down the road. Um, now on the back of the unit, or the back side of the unit, this is where your gas hot water heater is. You have an awesome uh, exterior LED light here. So again, early in the morning, late at night, you can see what you're doing. Your power hookup, it is a detachable power cord. It will come with the power cord. It's 25 foot, 30 amp service. You have a hot and cold outside shower with your spray nozzle. And then you have all your uh, water fill station here. So fresh water, city water connect, and then your black tank flush. So just to explain this real quick, basically is your fresh water, fills your uh, holding tank underneath. Your city connect is a direct feed of water, bypasses your holding tank. And then your black tank flush and hook a garden hose to that. So when you're dumping, you can flush the inside of your black tank, keep it from smelling, get all that loose sediment out of there. And then you have not only cable hookup, but satellite hookup, depending on what's at that campground. Um, you can do either or. And then other, under your bottom bunk inside for outside storage, you have an additional uh, outside storage here or under the uh, bunk bed. And then obviously your slide system. So. What I love to point out about the slide system, this works on an AccuSlide cable pulley system. So no matter where it is in its progression, it's always 100% sealed. The, the slide itself is not tipping out or tipping in. Um, also, having this slide system takes anywhere from three to 500 pounds off the unit weight because using this versus your heavy duty metal bars underneath. Um, inside, there's a manual override above the slide. Uh, on the other side of the fascia inside, where if this ever fails on you, you can manually take this in and out with a drill. Uh, let's jump inside. All right guys, so now we're inside the 2022 Alpha Wolf 26 DBH. So again, great floor plan, double wide bunks, queen bed up front. Um, so a little bit up front right here, right when you walk in the main entry door, you got your entertainment system. So great place to put a TV. Uh, they recommend 32 inch typically. Got all your TV hookups up top. Plus they throw a little hole here. So if you wanted a TV in the bedroom, you can feed the wires through for the TV in the bedroom. Uh, nice little shelving unit. This is prepped for the Wi-Fi. Um, if you have questions on that, again, give us a call. We can explain what the Wi-Fi prep is to you. Uh, radio, AM, FM, Bluetooth capable. So you can pair your phone to that. And again, play music inside, outside, both. You can zone them in and out, whatever you like to do. USB charger ports to charge phones. Again, you can kind of use this shelf to charge your phones up. And then a fireplace that does radiate heat and or you could just kind of kick it on and, and uh, you know, have it as, as a background uh, kind of look for a fireplace. And there are three different uh, colors there. There's yellow, blue, and red. Um, moving more into the bedroom, you have a full queen bed, LED lights above. They are actually putting doors on your uh, storage compartments up top. A lot of other companies kind of leave that open or put a net there. These guys are actually putting the doors up top. You have wardrobe on both sides of your bed, real deep for storage and a hanging bar. And you have the mirrors here. So if you're changing, you want to look, see what you're looking like before you go out on the campground, you could do so. Uh, we'll come with the sheets and the pillows. Um, you have USB charger ports on both sides of the bed. So on, on that side, that is a charger for a uh, Bluetooth speaker. I believe it's through Lipper. Uh, they sell it right off their website if you want it, but there's still USB charger ports on that charger. And then your 110 outlets as well for, again, charging phones, alarm clocks, CPAP machines, you name it. There is a nice shelving unit here. So again, if you have a CPAP machine, it could set there. 
And then under the bed, you do have storage. And what's nice is you do have a hydraulic lift, which will keep the bed up. So moving more out in the uh, living area. So we'll start with the kitchen first. All seamless countertops, no tea molding, very easy to keep clean. Pull down residential spray nozzle, all black. Uh, kind of matches the, the uh, hardware here on the cabinets as well. With the sink, it will come with the cover. Sink is one, one bowl stainless steel farm style sink. So putting a hot pan in there, you're not gonna hurt this sink. Plus they're adding this uh, hand sanitizing station, which you can easily just put hand soap in there if you want to. So you have uh, you know, nothing really cluttering up your counter space. Cause again, counter space is key for, um, you know, coffee makers, air fryers, toasters, you name it. You still have all this uh, space for that. You do have 110 outlets up above uh, to plug all that stuff in. Then you have three drawers that pull all the way out, more of your silverware drawer here, and then just open storage drawers, uh, drawers right here. Again, they come all the way out, no dead space on the bottom, all plywood construction with the roller, roller glides. A uh, bit of storage underneath the sink as well. Just a little bit, I mean, this is hiding most of the plumbing that's behind there, plus your outside kitchen that's there. But again, a little bit of storage, it's better than wasted space. Microwave, stainless steel, hood range. Then you got your pull away bamboo cutting board. So very easy to keep clean, doesn't soak in the juices, because again, it's bamboo versus just solid wood. And then when you're not using it, it kind of acts as a backsplash, all magnets to hold that up. Uh, three burner cooktop with the glass over top of it to give you additional counter space while prepping food. And then all you have to do is split this up. Again, yeah, kind of acts as a backsplash as well with the help of the uh, cutting board behind it. You have a full oven plus your LED lights to kind of light up, give you that, that nice pop. Uh, but a good, good size oven for cookies, French bread pizzas, you name it. And then your furnace is located right underneath of the, uh, the stove. Their new 11 cubic Canon 12 volt refrigerator gets cool in about 30, 40 minutes. And it's deep, it's real big. You don't have the metal coils in the back taking up space in room. Uh, and again, all 12 volt. So this is, this is another big bonus of having that juice bag, that solar panel on the roof, uh, charge your battery. If you do any dry camping, I mean, your fridge is good to go. You don't have to be wasting your propane on your fridge. That propane could be doing your furnace, your hot water heater, you name it. I mean, all 12 volt. Then you have a giant pantry right next to it. Nice LED light in there held by these strong, strong magnets, no door latches anymore. And then with the shelving units inside, they, they're building in a lip. So cereal boxes, things that you're putting in here, when you get to where you're going, when you open the door, it's not just gonna fly out at you because they're actually putting a lip in there, not just open shelving. Uh, double wide bunk beds in the back. This is the key feature here uh, for the kiddos. We'll have the built-in ladder already, so it's easy up and down for them. Um, LED lights on both bunks, plus on this side, you, each bed has its own USB charger ports plus 110 outlets, so the kids wanna charge their phones, tablets, have a laptop, you name it. Each bed will have its own. Plus you have additional storage underneath the bottom bunk. Uh, for all their, you know, backpacks, cl you know, clothes, duffel bags, you name it. Because, again, storage is a big, big key here uh, for any type of camper out on the market. AC unit, ducted throughout. It's a 15,000 BTU AC unit, not the small 13.5. So it'll keep it real nice and cold. And then with the Alpha Wolves, it's block foam insulation, not bad insulation. Holds better R value. It's more dense of, a, of an insulator. Uh, plus, on the cold winter days... Um, this doesn't full, have a fully enclosed heated underbelly. As long as your furnace is on, you're heating that underbelly. So it's a good extended season. I wouldn't call it four season, but early spring, late fall, some winter camping you can get away with, and it, you'll stay A, warm inside, and or AC on. It'll keep the cold in and keep the heat out. So insulation works both ways. Um, all LED lights inside, nice pendant lights up top. Huge U-shaped dinette. Um, plus this can drop down, make into a bed. Two people comfortably can sleep on this, even two adults. Um, really cool this year, the zebra shades. So you can have a total blackout. Actually, it's easier to see here. So total blackout, if you just go a little bit more, you really don't see the silhouette of somebody. So if it's light inside, dark outside, sometimes you can see the silhouette of people. In uh, With the zebra shades being total blackout, you don't have that because it's the same material on the opposite side. Or 
if you just want sun to come in or the light to come in, you can do it that way as well. Under both sides of the U-shaped eye net, you have these two big drawers that pull all the way out. Not just cabinet doors where you'll lose stuff at the back of your dinette. Um, you can just keep everything right there. And again, on both sides, identical giant drawers. Uh, three seat sofa right next to the U-shaped dinette. This will make into a bed. I'll get these armrests off. So it's just like a jackknife sofa, uh, lace flat, uh, kind of like a futon. And then even underneath, you have storage underneath. You know, it's board games, you name it, you can put under there. And then lastly, moving to the commode, the bathroom area. So it's a porcelain toilet, not a plastic toilet, foot flush. You have a full surround shower in here with the skylight up above to bring in that natural daylight. Another big thing they're doing is putting this max air fan in here uh, to really ventilate the steam or the smells. Oversized big sink here in the bathroom, not a small little dinky guy. Uh, motion light sensor, so you don't, late at night, early in the morning, you don't have to kick on these LEDs to kind of wake you up a bit. Um, medicine cabinet up top with the mirror, and you have tons of storage behind it. And then a bit of storage underneath the sink as well for toilet paper towels, you name it. Another, another nice part I, I like to uh, talk about with this unit because you have two door entry. So that second door is a quick in and out of the unit. You don't have to keep tromping through with muddy shoes or, you know, some campgrounds aren't all asphalt and concrete. So on those rainy days, you don't want a bunch of mud leading all the way to the bathroom. It's a quick in and out. So again, my name's Mike, All Seasons RV. This is the 2022 Alpha Wolf 26 DBH. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call, 330-564-0222. Again, our website, asrvs.com. Check us out on uh, Facebook, YouTube. We do a bunch of videos like this, also on maintenance. So feel free to give us a call. Appreciate it. Thanks. Happy camping.